T17 affirms the commitment, determination and dedication of the board, management and staff of Ghana Airports Company Limited to sustain the strong performance of the company against the background of some few notable challenges on the economic front. According to the Africa Outlook Report for 2018, aviation in Africa supports currently 72.5 billion United States dollars in economic activity and 6.8 million jobs. But paradoxically, Africa's proportion of the global tourism industry is receding as the continent's share shrinks from 4.8% of global arrivals and receipts in 2006 down to 3.3% in 2016. Africa's potential remains massive, but until more major stakeholders like governments and corporations like ours recognize the wider benefits that an efficient aviation system can bring, with its impact on economic development, that persistent decline that we have seen over the last decade might continue. An important first step would be to remove counterproductive taxation systems, but much remains to be done on the essentially protectionist regulatory front. IATA, the International Air Travel Association, predicts air travel growth in Africa will outpace all other regions of the world over the next 20 years, albeit from a much smaller base. Positively, IATA expects 8% growth in demand, slightly outpacing capacity expansion of 7.5%. Here in Ghana, we are fortunate to have the support of government which through the 2017 budget removed the 17.5% VAT on domestic airfares to make domestic travel more affordable. I am happy to note that as a result of this policy intervention, there has been a notable increase in the domestic passenger throughput. It is gratifying to note that the company played host to the first African Aerospace Conference and Exhibition in Ghana from October 24 to 26, 2017. The event put Ghana on the world, as far as aviation was concerned, on the world map and attracted over 300 exhibitors, 15,000 trade visitors and 150 participating delegates, as well as the attention of local and foreign media. Financial Review The company's financial position for the year 31st December 2017 shows that the company recorded profit after tax of about 87 million Ghana CDs against 2016 figures of about 153 million. Although 2017's net profit of about 87 million CDs was not momentous compared to recent past years, Ghana Airports Company Limited, however, exhibited strong resilience as a growing concern by posting impressive total revenue of over 440 million, which is 21% above the previous year. 2017 saw considerable progress across a varying range of vital areas for the company. The company saw another year of record passenger volumes, air traffic movements, freight, goods transported by airplane, in the face of market uncertainties. Stated capital went up to 4.855 billion CDs in 2017, from 1 million CDs in 2016, representing an increase of force in local communities where our airports are located mainly Accra, Kumasi, Sunyani, and Tamale. Our corporate social responsibility is focused on health, education, and also on the environment and its improvement. In 2017, we engaged in some philanthropic activities, including support for Breast Care International for their annual Breast Cancer Awareness Walk. 
we continue to support Women in Aviation International's Ghana Chapter for the Girls in Aviation Day event held annually. Our staff continue to contribute to the Ghana Hearts Foundation through monthly deductions from their salaries as a means of alleviating the plight.